appreciate my advisor, Dr. Chang, who helped me. Up to here, whatever value or data that we have, we just have radio frequency data. We need to convert them to image. So we use this conversion through two processes, applying inverse fast Fourier transfer. The first algorithm that we use is Graha. Graha means generalized photocategorizing partial parallel acquisition. What you see here is a portion of our under sample data. Okay? We have four blocks. You can see four blocks, and each block, in each block, we have one accurate data. Accurate data means where we have the full daytime information of that uh, signal. And then we have this unaccurate data where the Graha algorithm through this regression analysis try to fulfill this missing case based data. So once it goes under the process, they call it auto calibration uh, signal one. We came up with this conclusion that our assumption in the one that we consider at the beginning, the positive effect of the standard learning on parallel MRI reconstruction is true. We discovered that applying different ways of learners to back in technique does not lead to improved results even if the highest weight applies to the strongest learner and the smallest weight to the big mother. Yes. Yeah, I was wondering, uh, so you removed a uh, graphite because obviously it was super slow. Yes. Uh, and then, and then when, you, when you got the results, did you go back and just try it with a graphite just to see if, you know, the, the ensemble results with that one would get even better or? The result of the single one was not matter. Even my grandpa had a good quality and applied that one that symbol can improve 100%. No, there wasn't such kind of things. But I grandpa by itself is a good uh, reconstructed algorithm. I see that you tested your algorithm on different data sets. Yes. And uh, these data sets are all red, right? Yes. Okay, so my question is actually on you know, two parts. First of all, do you think that your um, algorithm will produce the same similar similar performance on um, other data sets which is non-random methods. In different data sets it was absolutely different as you can see mm -hmm. like in three different so the evaluation that came out. 